Good morning. The centre has managed to survive the numbers game in Parliament with the help of regional parties, but the roadblocks lay ahead. The government's resolve will be tested when it decides to push the hard policy decisions such as fuel price hike. It is also under pressure to roll back the proposed railway fare hike. The status quo seems to be UPA 2's mantra for stability, but persistent struggle on policy making doesn't bode well for the economy. The markets will continue to be jittery unless the government managed to spring a pleasant surprise. The opening today will be seeded due to weak global queues. US stock indices closed in the red. European stocks were down sharply. Asian benchmarks are mixed. The latest fall in global markets has come due to concerns over slowdown in China. China's flash manufacturing PMI due on Thursday will be closely watched. Back home, the key indices may fall further if FII flows turn negative. The next big trigger will be quarter for earnings and the RBI policy meet, both are due next month. The Nifty traded in a narrow band of 5,230 to 5,300 on Tuesday after violating the rising support line below 5,330. The current fall is expected to continue in the near term with immediate support seen in 5,160 levels. Keep an eye on Satyam Computers and Mahindra Satyam as the board of the two IT companies announce a merger. The aviation sector will continue to be in the spotlight as well. The FI is when it buys of Rs 1.11 billion in the cash segment on Tuesday, while the domestic institutional investors when it sellers at Rs 1.2 billion as per the provisional figures released by the NSC. The FI is when it buys of Rs 6.89 billion in the FNO segment on Tuesday, according to the provisional NSC data. The foreign funds were net buys of Rs 1.85 billion in the cash segment on Monday as per the SEBI website. Mutual funds were net sellers of Rs 894 million on the same day. Moving on to recommendations, the technical call for the day is, we advise buying SOBA developers above Rs 305 with a stop loss of Rs 299 and for the target price of Rs 318. Our derivative strategy for the day is long dish TV March futures above Rs 54 with a target price of Rs 58 and a stop loss placed at Rs 52. Thank you. Wish you have a great day.